Here's your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, after just a beautiful summer day today, temperatures topping out in the low 80s. We bring back some slightly cooler weather for Saturday and keep an eye to the sky, scattered showers and at times a few thunderstorms. Looking at uh, Newport, actually real nice. You had some light showers earlier this evening, but it's been you know a decent night. It hasn't been stormy. Uh, however, later tonight and you know well after midnight pre dawn hours, we've got a few thunderstorms rolling through a, a couple of communities. Boy, look at these temperatures today topping out in the lower 80s. Uh, we're forecasting things to be about 10 degrees cooler for tomorrow, about 70, 71, 72 degrees. It's in the 60s now in most areas, 67 Providence, mid 60s in Boroughville, uh, New Bedford now coming in at 63. Mainly cloudy skies, humid, but there's not much in the way of precipitation out there. So our threat tracker. We'll keep it elevated for Saturday for, you know, a heads up. Of course, very busy time of year, right? Weather's getting nice. A lot of activities this weekend, Father's Day weekend. Uh, scattered showers, which in itself is no big deal. But at times, these showers are going to be heavy with some embedded isolated thunderstorms as well. Some downpour, some poor visibility, some, some maybe some ponding of the water on the roads in some areas. Again, it's not every hour of the day, but it's one of those you could kind of keep an eye to the sky. You're going to have to dodge some of these downpours and isolated thunderstorms. Sunday, Father's Day is not a perfect day, but by no means is it like Saturday. It's much better. In fact, even some peaks of sun through the clouds uh, during the afternoon, drier than Saturday, other than an isolated shower. I think there'll be many hours where it's actually dry on Father's Day Sunday. So some good news there. A cloudy sky, some light precipitation offshore, but uh, we're tracking this system. Uh, actually, two areas of disturbed weather in the upper part of the atmosphere. Here's the first one. Here's the second one. Both sort of work in tandem, kind of spin on top of us, producing some of the scattered precipitation coming up for overnight tonight and especially on Saturday. When we walk you through the forecast and you can see during the overnight, one, two o'clock in the morning, a little isolated thunderstorm coming through. Here we are tomorrow morning. This is 8 a.m. Starts off in the low 60s. Any sun and there's not much would be brief. The clouds will fill right back in. So it's really both morning and afternoon afternoon. The chances there for some scattered showers and thunder, though kind of leaning more towards the afternoon. And notice that one o'clock in the afternoon, you get these blips of red. So these are some downpours and some thunderstorms. You get the idea. Not every community gets one, but most areas do see showers throughout the day into early tomorrow evening. This is six o'clock and then later tomorrow night, 10, 11 o'clock, still tracking some wet weather. So for tomorrow morning, starting off in the 60s with scattered showers likely running about a 70% chance. I think the thunderstorm risk starts to increase a bit more uh, during the afternoon. Scattered showers and thunder, a few downpours. Be careful traveling. Temperatures in the lower 70s. Boaters, be mindful of that. Now, even though it is scattered, the risk of some lightning. Uh, the wind northeast and then turning northwest 5 to 10. Obviously not... Uh, not a great beach day coming up for tomorrow. A little better though Sunday afternoon. All right, there's your seven day forecast. And tell you what, Father's Day Sunday, again, it's not perfect, but it is better. A little partial sunshine in the afternoon, 72 degrees, and just an isolated shower, about a 20% chance. I think most of the time the weather is dry and some decent weather for next week as well.